Pixel Titan Strafe exists as a proper continuation of the Quake, Doom, and Wolfenstein era of shooters, while also moving the genre forward with some excellent improvements like the procedurally generated maps that give the game tons of replayability. In the spirit of those id shooters, you play as an everyman who finds himself in a very bad situation with only guns and his reflexes to keep him on the side of the living. You must fight through a massive ship called the Icarus, taking down demonic enemies whose only goal is to kill you. It's simple enough. I had a chance to play Strafe at this year's PAX East and was pleasantly surprised by the seemingly endless ways you can kill your way through the always changing corridors and rooms of the Icarus. Before the action begins, you get to choose between three starting weapons. Among them a powerful shotgun and a machine gun. You also get a pistol and your fists. It's easy to get cornered or go down a room full of enemies or fall into a pit, especially since you'll never be familiar with the map. So it was helpful to find powerful lasers that could dispatch several enemies at once. The closest I can describe to it is the Doom shotgun. In fact, Strafe is exactly the cure for gamers who recently felt burned by Doom's new multiplayer experience. There's no lack of identity in what Strafe wants to be. This is run, shoot, strafe, dodge. And it absolutely succeeds as both an arcade experience and a hardcore shooter. Strafe is scheduled for a 2017 release for PC.